What's up fellow earthlings? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Austin Lee Hires. For those of you that are just joining in, please hit that subscribe button down below if you're not a subscriber yet. And if you guys leave a comment down below, you get a chance to be shouted out on my channel like this person right here. I shout out on my channel almost every video when I can remember to one of you subscribers. Thank you for constantly and consistently commenting on my channel. All right, guys, this worked on the last video, so I'm going to go ahead and do it again. Before we even get started, hit that like button, please. I want to get it up over 100 likes, just like I did on the last video. Thank you for all those 102 people that hit the like button so far on the last video. It's only up to like 400 views and we hit 102 likes. I want to do that same thing, but even more likes on this video. Thank you so much. Enjoy the rest of it. Let's get on. So you saw the title right. Today, we're gonna to talk about the top five habits that help me create a successful business and grow uh, to the scale that I am right now. We're going to keep growing and growing and growing uh, with these top habits as long as we keep them habits and we keep doing them uh, habitually on a daily basis. So I wanted to go ahead and give a, uh, a thank you to all of my subscribers that watch my channel and watch my videos all the way to the end as much as possible. I just got monetized, so woohoo! thank you guys uh, I don't know how much I'm gonna be making off of YouTube yet but I do want to turn this into a, another stream of income for myself and my family so all of you guys thank you you are a part of that and I appreciate you 100% I'm gonna keep making these videos so you can learn stuff uh, from me and uh, and that way I feel like I'm earning my money so let's go ahead and get started with the video guys so habit number one the first habit that helps my business grow is constantly telling people about my service and my business. What I mean by this is that you should always be talking about your business or your service if you want it to consistently grow. If you want it to keep getting bigger and better and more people knowing about it, that takes word of mouth and talking about it. Word of mouth is literally one of the best ways to spread the knowledge about your business and what you do and your personality is your business when you get started so if you're not a good salesman try to hire somebody that is exactly the opposite and have them go out and be that salesman for you um, and talk to people tell anybody and everybody I'm at the grocery store and I'm wearing my shirt almost everywhere I go if people ask me a question I just start talking about it uh, before you know it I'm handing out four or five cards right there on the spot in the grocery store so that's the first habit I wanted to go ahead and tell you guys about that really helped me grow and uh, it continues to help me grow to this day. The second habit that helps me grow, habit number two. All right, so this one is super simple and people tell you this all the time. Um, get reviews, ask for reviews. This is another one of those things that helps your business grow and it's not very hard. All you gotta do is ask. Verbally ask the customer or client when you're done with the job, hey, would you mind taking two minutes of your time? I'll send you a quick link, and all you have to do is write a few words in there and leave us five stars. I always put in there five stars, so I know, so they know specifically that I, I want a five-star review from them uh, for our services. And majority of the time, we'll get a five-star review. I literally, uh, you could check my Google accounts, guys, Let It Go Junk Removal. I have four Google accounts, and not one of them have uh, has a four-star or low. Every single one has a five-star review. I like to do it before I take payment. When I'm taking payment from my customer at the end of the day, I ask them, before we take payment, would you mind taking two minutes out of your time to leave us a review on Google? I can send you a quick link and all you have to do is click on it and leave us a five-star review. And that's what I like to do before I even make payments. So that way, uh, you know you got that review before you left the job. And it works a lot of times. They'll whip their phone out and they'll do it right there. So you'll be surprised, try it out. Okay, let's move on. So habit number three, you guys, 
This is a, a great habit and, and anybody should have this uh, habit in their arsenal of habits. So I have an arsenal of habits, guys. Uh, habits run your life. Habits make every decision that you do on a daily basis. Um, so uh, our, uh, habits are you in essence. So this is what I'm trying to say. So habits are you. All right. So habit number three, we're talking about saving money for a rainy day. So anytime that you're really rocking and rolling and the business is going and making uh, the amount of money that you need to make to feel profitable, put that money away and save it, save it, save it, save 10% of it in a totally different savings account and, uh, and for a rainy day because like I talked about in a previous video, you might just have those days where you break down, you need an oil change, you need new tires, your starter breaks, uh, like happened to me just a week ago, I had to get a new starter. That was 236 bucks, guys. So if I didn't save any money, I wouldn't have been able to pay for that. Um, so that's the third habit that, that can help you really grow your business is knowing right off the bat, you need to save that profit for rainy days. Habit number four is always doing my best. And what I mean by always doing my best is exactly what I say. Wherever I go, whatever I do, whether it's for my business or not, I always do my best. I don't sit there and do a half-assed job just because it's not my house, um, and, and, or 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 just uh, I don't I don't I don't do anything but 100%. So I don't even know what to tell you about us about slackers because I've never been a slacker. One thing I can say about myself is my drive um, to always do my best has always been way, way, way up there. My drive is, has skyrocketed in the last year even. And um, always doing your best. So when you show up on a job, you want to make sure that you do 100% because you want that customer to be a return customer. You want them to use you again, right? Um, we all do. We all want return customers. So always do your best when you're out on these jobs. Always do your best when you're when you're out just uh, shopping at Walmart. Do your best when you're out helping your family with something or your friends with something. Always do your best and people will know that's your character and they'll recommend you right off the bat, uh, right away, every single time. So um, let's get on to the, uh, the next habit. All right, guys, habit number five. Let's go ahead and get on to habit number five. This is perhaps the most important habit of all, habit number five, okay? So you guys remember this one. Remember habit number five, I saved the best for last. You literally have to wake up every day with a smile on your face, with a go-getting attitude, and just hustle. Just hustle away, guys, um, with a happy attitude and turn lemons into lemonade, that kind of attitude. Um, I know, I know, I know everybody gets upset and you're allowed to be upset. We're allowed to express our feelings and be angry at certain things. But let the small things go, guys. Be happy for what you have. Um, feel blessed that you can wake up every day and get your hustle on and do your best to make money, to be a millionaire or whatever you want to do in life. Um, and, and, and always, always, always remember when you wake up every day that it's a new day and there's nothing that's impossible. There's a new day which means new opportunities and, um, and, and maybe even a new way of life for you. It can happen just like that as long as you keep the right attitude. So staying positive, that's number five. And the most important thing that I could tell you guys to do to keep your business growing and, uh, and exceed your limits. So I really appreciate you watching this quick video today. Thank you so much for joining in once again. My name is Austin Lee Hires. Hit subscribe if you haven't done that already. And peace out.